Hi guys, we've just released the ISOs of the 1st of October and Eric is already working on the one from November. <laughs> but topic of the video is the comparison between the Arch Linux ISO and the Arch Linux ISO. What's actually different on permissions, on services, on everything. And there are two things I want to make an extra video about. FS trim is one and the ZRAM generator. So this video will be then about FS trim. And all you need to type is something like this or how to improve your SSD or NVMe, stuff like that, because SSD, solid state drive, that is what's all about FS trim, the Arch manual pages. Now, is it good? Is it not good? I'm not going into that, right? You just decide whether you use it or not. Um, <laughs> read. Um, there was somewhere mentioned, okay, this lifetime of poor quality SSD teams might negatively affect lifetime. So it's entirely up to you to decide. That's why it's not by default on, but it is by default on on Arch. So if you want to stick around and say, I want to have Arch Linux, but with the same settings of Arch Linux, then you need to activate this F FS trim thing. So solid state drive disk trim. And number one is actually all you need. And that's um, the periodically here. Periodic trim is what you need. It's already installed. You got it. The only thing you have to do is not this one, but activate the timer and the timer will weekly activate the service. So if you say, okay, I'm gonna try this out, this trim service, you read about it on other channels and other articles. Technically you need to do sudo system CTL and then enable FS trim. FS, did I type it right? FS trim timer now oh, yeah dot timer so the timer should be enabled that's it and it was already enabled so if i disable this thing yeah because this is a uh, virtual machine right i was playing with it already disable so you see what line should come there if it was not enabled then this line should appear and if it does not it's not enabled simple as that so have a look at this particular folder because it points to another folder. So here is the, actually fi the actual file and that is just a symbolic link. Voila, you're set to go. That's it. Stop. End the video. This is it. Super simple. And um, that's how you can enable the periodic rim. So stay 100% the same as Arch. That's released now the 1st of October. All right. Next video, set RAM generator.